Hey everyone, I just found out something pretty cool. Apparently, there is a way in Elite Dangerous to look at anything in the system map like you would a regular planetary body. Uh, I'm just going to get right into it and show you real quick. It's super, super simple. Let's just say we are visiting Seoul. Uh, I'm, I'm out searching for other stuff right now. Go to the system map. Open it up, obviously. And you can look at any one of these planets, gas giants included, anything that doesn't normally let you have a system uh, planetary map. You can look at any of these you want. It's super simple, and the only thing it requires is a landable body. So let's say, for example, we want to look at Earth over here. Uh, normally, you look at Earth, you would have to go and visit it, or you have to find a way to look at pictures on the internet or something like that. Like You can't really see its planetary body because anything that's not landable has this little button grayed out. However, you can actually still look at it. All you got to do, find a planet that has landable surface, so something like this that lets you already open up the planetary map. Go kind of select it over here, and you see a little button down here that says zoom in. For me, it's Z. For you, it could be whatever. Uh, basically, you're going to move your mouse really, really fast all around this guy over here, and you're going to zoom in. And boom. Works about 70% of the time. Uh, but you'll be able to zoom in onto anything that you want. Uh, you can see literally everything on the surface uh, from all the little surface features from the hurricanes to uh, United States and anything you want. And this, this works for any body. So if I want to look at Mars, I could try and shake it all around and boom. We're now looking at the surface of Mars as it is in Elite Dangerous. Uh, it's, it's super simple. You can do it on everything. And the coolest part is that, again, it also works on things like gas giants. So we're going to go down to this body up here, sh <clears throat> shake the mouse around a bunch, and boom, we can now zoom into the surface of Jupiter. Um, it is a little funky. I don't really think you're supposed to be able to do this. So, like, the surface of Jupiter is a little bit pixelated. Um, but this this works on literally anything. Uh, we're going to actually we're gonna check out my home system. Uh, for my group, uh, which is 59 Virginis right here. And we go check it out. We have a bunch of stuff in here as well. So we've got our own Earth-like. Uh, we've got Alchemia. And if we go to a planet down here, put our mouse up here, shake it around, boom. You can zoom into it, look at this planetary map, uh, see the rings on it still. Rings still appear for whatever reason. Uh, and the other cool thing is you can also see like the atmosphere how that'll light up if you look at the sun a certain way. Uh, it's really awesome. It also works in stars. Uh, so if I go up here, shake it around, you can zoom into this brown dwarf. You can see the surface kind of moving around and being all cool. Uh, we can do it again with the gas giant. Click on a thing, shake it around, zoom it in. Boom. We're looking at the surface of a gas giant. Um, gas giants are actually kind of the coolest things because you can find a small cloud on the surface sometimes. You can zoom way into the clouds, and you can see that they're actually like volumetric a little bit. It's kind of hard to tell, but you can see a shadow, and the shadow does move a little bit as you move around the thing. So I, I personally think that's super fucking cool. Uh, it works, again, on literally anything, so here's another planet up here. Check it out. Um, yeah. I have not tried it with other bodies, I'm sure you can do it with neutron stars and black holes and all the other crazy stuff in there, but this is just for those bodies that uh, I can't get to right away. I think it does work on stations. I'm going to try it on a station real quick, too. Uh, just just for my own experimentation. So yeah, no, it doesn't, it doesn't work on stations, but technically I am zoomed into our station, but there's no surface map because there's no surface. Um, maybe in the future, the planetary map of a station will be an odyssey, for all we know. Same thing for carriers, I would assume. Uh, but yeah, so if we go check out, say, uh, I don't know, we've got Sagittarius up here. I don't think I have that. I'm trying to trying to remember a black hole. I know there's a neutron star right here. Let me check out the neutron star. Open that up. Oh, there's no. So there, there again, there needs to be a, a planetary body that you can already zoom into. But anyway, I hope that that gives somebody some information to check things out. There's a lot of different things you can check out. Uh, it works on anything that has a system map button. You just need another landable body. Um, and I 
I don't know if it would be possible to find anything any way like that, but hey, I think it's pretty cool. Thank you for watching.